Hello, folks. It's Pastor Nate with DeliveranceRevolution.org. And um, if this is your first time, you will need that website, DeliveranceRevolution.org. That's where the prayer page is, uh, where you have all the deliverance prayers and many other prayers and resources. And it's also where the Contact Us page is. It's where the schedule is uh, for the online deliverance room, which is our Zoom room where we have 12 meetings a week. They are two times a day, 11 a.m. Eastern and 7 p.m. Eastern. So write that down if you would like to be discipled. Tonight, we're doing self-deliverance on deliverance from your own mind and demons of fear, okay? And it's going to be a long one, so stay with it. I want you to use the pause button because I'm going to go at a certain speed, but you can pause and stay here as long as you need. You got the video. And if you look down in the description of the video, you have the PDF, which shows you the prayer that I'm reading from. Okay, so click pause and play as much as you need to slow this thing down. And the first thing I want you to do is remember, please like, subscribe, and comment. I don't know why. We had a, a, an average of 255 subscribers for a 28-day period. Now we're down to 138. I don't know if it's this application doing it, YT doing it, or or what's happening. I really don't know. It's because of the content that we work for Jesus mm -hmm. and cast out demons. I don't know. But we certainly need your help. Uh, we don't try to sell anything, protein powders or cryptocurrency gambling courses or any of that nonsense or life insurance. We're not going to say we're just men of God sold out for Jesus Christ and trying to save as many people as we can through Jesus Christ, help people get free from depression and perversion and so on so that's that's all this is about it's real simple we love you and we want to help you get free uh, so please like subscribe share this video get as many people to this youtube channel as you can to subscribe get as many people to these uh these videos for these prayers get as many people to the website deliverancerevolution.org you know do something good for people the internet's a very selfish place do something good for people if you want solid ground to sow into we believe this to be solid ground. There's many people that uh, tithe here and they've got a lot of freedom because like I said, we're not, we don't charge people. We're not trying to choke anything down your throat. We're not trying to trick anybody. You know, occasionally we got some videos of people being healed and we just put it up there. We don't know the people. They're from all over the world. And if, if we pray for somebody and all of a sudden they start walking and we say, are you healed? And they say, yeah, I can walk. We just put it on the video. We don't try to make anything of it or get anything out of it. It just is what it is. It's just God in action. I mean, that's all. <laughs> if you don't believe it, that's up to you. <laughs> we're not trying to charge you or get you anything out of you to believe it. We just believe in what we're doing, just like a Satanist hates Christians, and he hates what we're doing, and he hates everybody, and that's his thing, right, to serve himself and try to hate people. We're full of Jesus, and our thing is to try to save people and love people, okay? So that's that's the deal here, all right? We love you very much, and we thank you for joining us. Let's get started. The first thing I want you to do is say, Dear Lord Jesus, please save me. I surrender my life to you. I give you my life. Today, I die to my old self. I die to my old self and you can state what that is that you're dying to, folks. I die, meaning you give up, you disavow, you renounce the old self. Okay? I die to myself. I give my life to you. I want to serve you. I come out of agreement with sin, fornication, perversion, addictions, anger, bitterness, wrath, hatred, whatever those things are. If they're not working for you and you're tense and anxious and miserable and oppressed and depressed, then try Jesus. Do something different. It's okay. It's okay to seek a better way. Surrender. Lord, please anoint this prayer. Even if I'm dead and gone and it's on the internet for 20 years, anoint this prayer. Use this video right here to bring people to you, Lord, for many years to come. So many lost and brokenhearted people out there, Lord. Use this video. Use this prayer. I'm certainly nothing special. I'm just a servant of yours. 
I'm not trying to sell anything to anybody. I just want people to get free. And I want you to be glorified. I want them to know that it's you. So say, Jesus saved me and I renounce my sin. Now I want you to go to whoever you need to forgive. Who has wronged you that you need to let go? Let go of the hatred. Let go of the bitterness. Let go of the anger. Come on, who is that? Nobody can hear you. Say it. Who do you need to let go of the bitterness and the anger? Forgive them. Say, Lord Jesus, take this unforgiveness. Forgiveness is a state of being. It's not a feeling. Now, who do you need to apologize to? Who? What do you need to ask the Lord forgiveness for? Say, Lord, forgive me for hating this person. Forgive me for not forgiving this person. Forgive me of my perversions, my addictions. Throw your pills in the toilet. Fire your psychiatrist. Turn to Jesus. If you're going to a cold, dead, demonized church, then stop. Go to a spirit-filled church. Come to our groups every day. It's like a church. We'll baptize you the whole nine yards. Teach you the word of God. Turn from your old life. And turn to this life through Jesus Christ. He loves you. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever shall believeth in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. The next verse says, God sent his son into the world, Jesus, to save the world, not to condemn it. The world through him might be saved, but man not might not perish. And lastly, we break every generational curse. Lord, I stand in with this person and we go to the courts of heaven and break every generational curse off their family. We ask that you release their family, Lord. Please come in agreement with this, folks. Remember, folks, you're going to have to forgive. You're going to have to change to be able to get free. You've got to come to the end of yourself. The Lord responds to the humble, not the proud, okay? All right, let's get going. Today, I'm going to be commanding out all demons that affect and afflict the mind. And guys, I will have to look down some because I'm reading off a prompter, but my camera's right above the screen. It's not in the screen, it's above it. So I'm going to have to look back and forth. So you adjust as need be. All demons that afflict the mind. I'll be coming against confusion, mental torment, doubt, unbelief, fear, and anxiety. Please take this time to forgive anyone you need to before proceeding. Repent for withholding forgiveness. Ask God to forgive you for that. Now repent for all your sin, known and unknown. Again, pause. Take a minute. Well, I know we already did this once. Take a minute. Put me on pause. Be sure to repent for any time you've opened up your mind to the kingdom of darkness. Ouija boards. Psychics and believe demonic lies over the truth of God's word. Please pray this prayer. Father, I come before you now in the name of Jesus to ask you to deliver me from all mental torment. I renounce all demonic lies and demons afflicting my mind, including confusion, fear, anxiety, doubt, worry, unbelief, and all mental torment. I choose to believe you and not the enemy. I thank you in advance for setting me free. In Jesus' name, amen, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray that your fire would go through your children's minds and bodies and destroy all strongholds that are housing demons. I come against all demons that are afflicting and oppressing them in their mind. I command all serpents, serpents, that are wrapped around the mind to release them now in Jesus' name. All mental torment, including condemnation, depression, doubt, and unbelief, come up and out right now in the name of Jesus Christ. All demons that hinder people from thinking on the things of God throughout the day be broken off the mind right now in Jesus' name. All tormenting demons and fear demons up and out of the mind and body right now in the name of Jesus. I bind the strong man and all the serpents in the mind. Release these children of God now. Any Jezebel, 
spirit sitting in the mind be uprooted now in the name of mighty Jesus, the Lord Jesus Christ. All demons wrapped around the neck and spine, I command you, uncoil. Come out in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I command all mental torment, mental blockers, confusion, doubt, distraction, and apathy to be broken off the mind right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Father, your word says to not be conformed to the pattern of this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of our minds. So in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray that your children would receive a renewal of the mind right now as these demons leave. And remember, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word of God, folks. Chapter and verse. Get into the word of God. Do the 30-day challenge off of the prayer page. You'll see it. Start at the top. Scroll down. You'll see a 30-day Bible challenge. Start right there. I don't have time to explain it, but all demons leave. Father God, I pray that you will transform them in their mind in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ in Nazareth, I command all demons that torment the mind to release these people now. All marine kingdom spirits in the mind, I command you to come up and out of them now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every demon that has a claw in their frontal lobe, I command you to pull your claws loose and come out of them right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I come against all demons that are afflicting people in their frontal lobe. Come out all witchcraft and confusion. Keep looking in my eyes, folks. Pause and stop as much as you need to. Don't get all panicked and scattered. If it takes you two days, do a little fasting while you're doing this. Maybe just eat one meal a day and do this prayer for two days. And folks, quit sinning. Just stop. Stop the porn. Stop the masturbation. If you're having sex with someone you're not married to, stop. Quit smoking dope. Quit eating CBD gummy bears or whatever you're doing. Stop. If you're playing horrible video games and you're starting to manifest demons, stop. Turn from your sin and repent. 1 John 1, 9 says, If you will confess your sins, he is faithful and just to forgive you of your sins and cleanse you of all unrighteousness. You've tried sin. And many of you, if you would just go at Jesus even half as hard as you did your sin, your entire life would change. Come out. Witchcraft, confusion, come out, deception, be uprooted now in Jesus' mighty name. All demons that are hindering your decision-making and causing distractions and fear, I command you demons, come out of the mind right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All demons that inject fear into the mind, I call fire down on you and command you to flee up and out in Jesus' name. Every demon must be broken off of the mind right now in the name of Jesus. Father God, I pray that your fire would go through their body from the top of their head to the soles of their feet to burn these demons out in Jesus' name. I command all demons afflicting the frontal lobe, pull your claws loose now in Jesus' name. I release the sword of the Spirit to cut these devils loose in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, come up and out all torment in the mind. I command every antichrist demon in the mind to be uprooted now in the name of Jesus. I command mental tormentors to flee. Remember, use your pause and play button. All fear and anxiety in the mind and the body, release the children of God now. All fear of condemnation, fear of accidentally blaspheming the Holy Spirit, fear of lost salvation, all these lies of the enemy, fear of the future, fear of death, fear of sickness, fear of the end times, fear of loved ones dying, come up and out of these people now in the mighty name of Jesus. All serpents that are called around the mind and head. I command you to loose your hold and come out now in the Jesus name. You demons are trespassing. You have to leave right now in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, I pray that a civil war would be loosed into Satan's kingdom right now in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. 
Father, please loose your cleansing fire on your children from head to toe in Jesus' mighty name. Pastor Nate's going to get some water. I pray that all these demons would be bound with fire. Every demon that is on a mission to torment people back into sin, I cancel your mission in Jesus Christ's name. I command you spirits to flee right now. Come up and all the way out in the name of Jesus. Every demon has to flee now in Jesus' name. We're giving you a direct command. We are tormenting you, demons. Leave now this precious soul. Father, I pray that your angels would pull these devils loose from the mind in Jesus Christ. Out of them, out of this precious soul in the name of Jesus. Father, please give them the mind of Christ. Please cleanse their mind from all unrighteousness. Please help them replace every lie from the enemy with your truth. Please give them a sound mind and give them clarity in Jesus' mighty name. All demons that try to fill the mind with clutter, confusion, and distraction, I command you to loose your hold and come out. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I thank you, Father God, for setting your children free. Father, I pray that you would fill them with your Holy Spirit and please fill the empty voids in Jesus' mighty name. All controller spirits and all octopus spirits wrapped around the mind, I command you to come up and out right now in the name of mighty Jesus. All controller spirits, you must let go of the mind in the name of Jesus Christ. All octopus spirits, you must release your grip and flee now in the name of Jesus. All demons that try to put a veil over the mind, over the forehead, over the eyes, I command you to come up and out in the name of Jesus. Every demon that injects intrusive, blasphemous thoughts, I call fire down on you now. Release their mind right now in Jesus' name. All rejection spirits, I command you to come out of the frontal lobe right now. Come out of the eyes. All demons in the forehead, be uprooted now in Jesus' mighty name. I command all mental tormentors to come out of the mind, eyes, ears, and mouth right now in Jesus' mighty name. Every demon that tries to torment people back into sin, come out right now in Jesus' name. All fear spirits that make people afraid to give up sin, out in Jesus' name. All fear spirits that make people afraid to stand up for the truth, come out in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I command every hook, every fang, every claw that the devil has in the minds to be pulled loose from these precious souls listening to this right now in Jesus' name. Don't forget to pause. Pause. You can pause it right now and start over and redo the whole thing. Do it over and over, or you can slow the speed down. Maybe some of you know how. Do it over and over. Quit sinning, repent, forgive. You don't have to fast. Maybe you want to skip one meal and drink some water and do this prayer for two days or three days. Press into Jesus. He will meet you where you are if you will quit sinning and press in. He'll even deliver a lot of you when you're in sin. It's called grace, but at some point, you've got to quit sinning. Men and women of God don't emphasize this enough because they're afraid of running you off. I don't really have anything to lose, so I tell you the truth. I'm not trying to get anything from you. I want to save your life. If you want to join our ministry, and come to our groups every day, you're welcome to do that. We'd love to have you. But we don't need you. We'd love to have you. So pray. If the Lord wants you there, come there. Well, I don't really need my glasses. The time I do these prayers, my eyesight gets corrected. Isn't that interesting? All demons that try to make people lust and go after carnal worldly things. Come up and out right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All demons that have people chained and bound to human reasoning and fear, come up and out right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command every demon to let go of the mind right now in Jesus' name. All mind-binding spirits, all evil memory recall spirits, all mental tormentors, I command you to be uprooted now 
and flee in Jesus' name. All fear spirits come up and out, out of the mind and body now. You are defeated in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I drive you devils out right now in the name of Jesus, every demon that's rooted in the mind. You spirits have to flee in Jesus' name. Come up, demons. You're being tormented. Let's go. I know you demons hear the sound of my voice. You will obey the name of Jesus. He defeated you. And this is a command. I'm commanding you to go where Jesus is sending you right now. I'm not asking. I command you, demon, that is afflicting and affecting the mind to loosen your grip right now and go in Jesus' name. If you're feeling nauseated or sick, that's good, folks. Those are demons. A lot of mucus or spit, crying, tears. Those are demons. Coughing, hacking, nausea, vomiting. Those are demons manifesting. That's a good thing. Don't quit. Keep going. Some of you got legions of demons and you say, come out, Le legion, in the name of Jesus. Be uprooted. Come out right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Be restored, you wicked works. And I command you to leave in Jesus' name. It is written, for this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. So I command every lying spirit, come out of the mind right now in Jesus' name. Every demon that tries to tell lies about Jesus and who you are in him, be uprooted and flee right now in Jesus' name. All demons who drive people to use pharmakia. Pharmakia means sorcery, antidepressants and all that, and all those anti-anxiety pills and all that. Loose these people now, demons, and go where Jesus sends you. All demons that set people up for failure, come up and out in Jesus' name. All demons that came down the bloodline, I break you off their bloodline right now in Jesus' name. All demons that came in through false religion, atheism, witchcraft, new age, the occult, I command you to come up and out of the mind, out of the flesh, out of the body right now. All demonic lies be uprooted now in Jesus' name. All religious spirits come out of the mind right now. All doubt and unbelief, I rip you out of the mind right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Father God, I pray that all doubt and unbelief that came in through false religions and practices be driven out in the name of Jesus. I command you doubt, unbelief, demons, to come out of the mind right now. All demons who try to get people to distrust God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit. I call fire down on you, and I command you to flee in Jesus' name. I break the doctrines of devils of the mind in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Father God, I pray that if there's any demonic doctrine binding their mind, that it be broken off now. Please help your children to believe the truth and not receive the lies of the enemy. Please help them overcome what is hindering them from believing the truth in Jesus' name. All lying spirits that try to manipulate the mind, loose the children of God now and flee in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus, I uproot all demons embedded in the neurons of the mind and the receptors. Come up and out right now in Jesus' name. Remember, folks, hit pause if I'm going too fast. Slow this thing down as much as you need to and look me in the eye. I'll do my best to look in the camera. I'm going back and forth down. All demons that inflict and manipulate the dopamine receptors, come up and out right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I command you demons to come out of the mind, come out of the frontal lobe, come out of the thought patterns, come out of their head and release their mind right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I pray that your children would be able to walk in clarity of mind in Jesus' name. Every demon that tries to mimic the voice of God, be uprooted and flee now in Jesus' name. All seducing and deceiving spirits that try to lead people astray in the mind, come up and out in the name of Jesus. All spirits of insanity, come up and out now in the name of Jesus. All wicked spirits sitting in the mind, clear out now in the name of Jesus. 
I command every demon that tries to block the truth to come up and out of the mind right now in the name of Jesus. Every lying and deceiving spirit that tries to lead people astray and into false doctrine, come up and out now in the name of Jesus. Every demon that came in through false teaching, I drive you out in the name of Jesus Christ's mighty name. Every demon that tries to get people to put their trust in men and their false doctrines and their drugs, come out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. All doctrines of devils and demons be driven out. All doctrines of false religion be living out, driven out in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Every mental tormentor, you will come up and out of the mind right now in Jesus' name. I pray that you would send fire down, fire down, Lord, on your children's mind, on these precious souls, and burn down all demonic strongholds right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All mental tormentors, you will release your grip in Jesus' name. Every claw, talon, come out of the mind and off the head now in Jesus' name. Every demon causing pressure on the head, loose the children of God now. All python spirits and kundalini spirits wrapped around the head, uncalled now and leave in Jesus' name. All spirits that try to cause headaches and vision problems, out fire upon you. May it be 770 times worse on your head and vision. Come out in Jesus' name of Nazareth. I command every demon to leave right now in Jesus' name. All pride and control spirits, deception spirits, come out of the mind in the name of Jesus Christ in his mighty name. In the name of Jesus, I break off every fiery dart that the enemy has shot into your mind. I loose cl clarity Boom, into it now in the name of Jesus. I command all the fear, anxiety, depression, be broken off your mind and body right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Say, I receive it, folks. Say, I receive every word that Pastor Nate is speaking because this is biblical. In the name of Jesus, binding fear, strong man of fear, commanding it to leave you now. All fear spirits that torment the mind come up and out in Jesus' name. Father, your word says that there's no fear in love, but perfect love cast out fear because fear involves torment. But he who fears has not been made perfect in love. So Father, I pray that you would please fill them with your perfect love to drive out all fear that is trying to torment your children. Please help them to not lean on their own understanding, but to acknowledge you in all of their ways. In the name of Jesus Christ, I come against every demon that tries to make people rely upon their own mental strength and intelligence instead of the wisdom of God. Come up and out right now in the name of Jesus Christ. All demons that hinder people from hearing the voice of God or hearing a uh, uh, injecting a false voice. Come out of the mind right now in Jesus' name. All the way out, demons. I command you to flee now in Jesus' name. I command you devils to come out through crying, yawning, coughing, burping, vomiting in the name of mighty Jesus. Again, we command you demons to come out through crying, yawning, coughing, burping, vomiting, leave right now in the name of Jesus Christ. There's still demons lingering. I drive you out in the mighty name of Jesus right now. All fear, anxiety, doubt, condemnation, I command you, come up and out of the mind right now in Jesus' name. All demons that try to torment people, with anxious thoughts and feelings in the body, I command you, release them now in Jesus' name. All demons that try to deceive people in their mind, come out right now in the name of Jesus. All fear spirits that try to sell you a lie, I uproot you now in Jesus' name. I say you can't overcome this in Jesus' name. That try to sell you a lie, I uproot you now. All fear spirits that say, you can't overcome this, or you're always going to fear and doubt. I call fire down on you. 
And I command you to release these people now in Jesus' name. All demons sitting in the mind, sitting in the mind, come out, come out, fire upon you right now. Look right in my eyes, fire upon you, demon. This precious soul is repented. Get out in Jesus' name. I command you, loosen your grip. Come all the way up out of them right now in Jesus' name. Now I command every demonic hook to be pulled loose from the mind in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. All octopus spirits and have tentacles of mind control around the mind. We sever them now in Jesus' name. Angels, cut them loose. You will loosen your grip and come out of them now. Let go of their mind now, demons, in Jesus' name. I am commanding you, spirits, loosen your grip, let go, and never come back. You have to leave right now. Jesus defeated you, and these people are under his blood. Father, I thank you for sending your precious son, Jesus, to destroy the kingdom of darkness. I ask you to please continue to cleanse the minds of your children. Thank you for dispelling and destroying every lie and work of the enemy. Thank you for setting your children free from all mental torment and bondage. Thank you that they now have the mind of Christ in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, and amen. Thank you, folks, for watching this again. If you like this and you want to be discipled, you want to be a part of our community, then we encourage you to go to Deliverance Revolution. Write it down, Deliverance Revolution. Dot org. Click the contact us button right Pastor Nate. I'll respond to you. I'll invite you. You can connect with me on Skype. Okay, start a relationship with us. We're like an online church. We're a 501c3 nonprofit. If you want to sow in, sow in. If you want a, a, a good ground to sow into, then sow into. Okay, go as the Holy Spirit and the Word of God leads you. I'll send you a couple of deliverance manuals if you'd like. I'll be glad to. And folks, that about covers it. I'm Pastor Nate with DeliveranceRevolution.org signing off from Deliverance from the Mind and Demons of Fear. Folks, that's a good one right there. Share that one. Send it around. God bless you. Thank you, and I love you. Bye-bye.